How special is this for you, considering it's the Lions, the team you grew up watching? Uh, you know, I think it's it's special from the standpoint that you get a, a chance to see a lot of familiar faces. You know, I've played against them, well, not played, but watched them play against the teams I've been on the last two years. So, you know, some of that goes away. That first year definitely was a little bit uh, interesting, mixed emotions going back to the visitor locker room in Ford Field. But, you know, after a while you move on. That, that's the way it goes. This league, there's so much turnover. There's so many different guys on that defense. There's only two guys that were with me a couple of years ago in Detroit. So, you know, it, it, yeah, they have the same helmets and, and same jerseys, but a lot of different guys over there. Drew, have you had a bigger week in your life? You uh, have a child, you get handed the keys to an 8 1 football team, and now you're going to go face your forward team. <laughs> uh, you know, I was probably a little bit more nervous when I had to go ask my father-in-law to marry my wife. That was that was a little bit more nerve-wracking than anything that I've probably done. But, you know, again, I, I think having the maturity to handle it now, being 30 years old, being in this league, and, and you know, trying to, again, take an approach of one day at a time, getting prepared for these guys, it's easier. And when I'm here, it's 100% football. And when I go home, it's 100% my family. And, you know, that's the way that I learned at a young age, and that's what's allowed me to have success and, and do stuff or otherwise, and, and I'll do that.